Howdy y'all, what up? Hoseman Mississippi here back with a new video. Welcome back once again to my channel. First of all, uh, I'm gonna ask y'all to please excuse the background noise. I have my APU and air conditioner running. It's like 95 degrees outside with a heat index of like 105. And that's Fahrenheit, of course. I don't know what that would be in Celsius for my uh, viewers uh, in Europe or uh, anyone who uses the Celsius scale, okay? But uh, anyway, it's really hot outside. I got the air conditioner running. Please excuse the background noise. Um, and uh, secondly, the pantyhose I have on are Sheertex Blue glow shear pantyhose <laughs> um, I don't think shear takes is making the glow shears anymore uh, I've ordered these pantyhose from them some years ago and uh, I've had them for a long time but anyway um, well the reason I'm making this video is I just uh, felt like making a video today and wanted to tell y'all kind of what's been going on um, well, of course, y'all can see I'm in my truck, and I'm at my home terminal. Uh, we call it the yard, okay? But I'm at I'm at the yard in North Mississippi, and I've been here since Friday night. And well, I could have gone home. Actually, I did go home, but when I got home, I discovered that my air conditioner had completely quit working. I had left my air conditioner on 80 degrees while I was gone for the two weeks, and when I got home, uh, the air conditioning unit was completely frozen up. There was literally layers of ice on the unit, and it, uh, when I walked in the door and looked on the thermostat, it was 97 degrees in the house. 97 degrees. I couldn't handle it. I couldn't take it. So, uh, but what I did do is I waited a little while for the air conditioner to thaw out some, for the unit to thaw out some, and I tried to turn the air conditioner on. It wouldn't turn on at all. So I said, forget this. You know, I couldn't handle it. It was way too hot in there. I was burning up uh, Winchester. My dog was burning up. And so, you know, I, I uh, loaded my stuff and him back up to my car and I came back to the truck which you know my, my APU and air conditioner work just fine in the truck and we've been comfortable in the truck all weekend I mean it, it sucks because there were some things I needed to get done at home but I couldn't do it because it was way too hot and uh, but think about it is I rent the place and so if anything goes wrong that's not my fault I'm not responsible for fixing it all I, all I do is put in a maintenance request to the uh, property company that I'm renting from, and they, they will send someone out to fix it. But anyway, it still sucks, and they better permanently fix the air conditioner this time because it's like the fifth or sixth time I've had to write, write up that air conditioner to be fixed. And I put in the maintenance request to either fix the thing or replace the unit entirely, completely replace the unit, because uh, it's uh, it's central air, and that, that air conditioning unit is old, I can tell it's old, and it probably needs to be replaced, but anyway, um, enough about that, another reason, uh, or another thing I want to talk to y'all about is, um, these pantyhose feel amazing, I love them, but anyway, uh, another thing I want to talk to y'all about is uh, some of y'all sometimes like to tell me what pantyhose to wear in my videos. And in a way, I don't mind that, but also in another way, I don't like it. Because nobody pays me for my content. YouTube doesn't pay me. My viewers don't pay me. And so I really don't like it when y'all tell me what to wear or what to do in my videos. Although occasionally I will ask y'all for a little advice or something, like uh, the little bit of fashion advice I asked for a couple of videos ago, 
uh, if, like if I should uh, continue wearing socks, if I should ditch the socks. Some of y'all said continue wearing socks, some of you said ditch them, and some of you said to buy no-show socks. And, uh, but I'll talk more, a little bit more about the no-show socks here in a minute. Uh, but about y'all telling me what to do in my videos. Um, well, if you want to start paying me uh, to shoot and upload content, then you can tell me what to do in my videos. You know, if you want to kind of be my YouTube boss or, or whatever, and you want to start paying me for my content, hey, that's fine. I'll take it. I'll take the money. <laughs> but if, if nobody wants to pay me for my content, then don't tell me what to do in my videos or what to wear in my videos. I'm going to wear whatever pantyhose I want to wear in my videos, okay? So, anyway. Um, now, more about the no-show socks. Uh, yesterday, when I went out shopping, I wore suntan legs pantyhose with denim shorts and this shirt. And one thing I bought was a package of no-show socks. I didn't wear socks yesterday. Uh, and uh, nobody really seemed to notice. I think I got a couple of little eye drops, but... Nobody seemed to notice. But anyway, um, so I bought a package of no-show socks. And then today when I went out, I, I also went out today. I went into town to get something to eat and pick up a couple of the things at Walmart that I forgot, um, that I forgot yesterday. And I wore the no-show socks. But think about the thing about the no-show socks, they, uh, they still, the top of those socks still kind of show above my shoes. You know, they still kind of show above my shoes, uh, and so they and, and they still kind of cover cover my ankles too. So if they do that, they're really not no show, are they? I, I would say not. They're they're more like low cut ankle socks. Okay, they're really like low cut ankle socks. But still, I bought a 12 pack of them. I'm gonna wear them with my shoes in the summertime or in the spring and summer. You know, I'm, I'm not gonna throw them away and. I opened the package and all that. I'm not going to take them back either. Uh, so, yeah, I'll just wear the no-show socks and, uh, you know, to, to keep the toe and foot area of my pantyhose from ripping. But, um, actually, the past few days, I've been wearing uh, suntan legs pantyhose with no, no socks. With no socks. And, well, my pantyhose haven't ripped. Thankfully, I guess I got lucky. I guess I've been getting lucky, but they haven't ripped. Uh, but, you know, I'm going to be wearing the no-show socks anyway. Uh, now, enough about that. I just, you know, wanted to tell you all that as well. Um, uh, sorry, y'all. But anyway, another thing I want to say is I am now at 794 subscribers. So I'm nearing 800 and for those of you who are subscribed to my channel, thank y'all so, so very much. Y'all freaking rock. Please keep it up, okay? And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you'll know when I've uploaded a new video. And, well, if you have any questions or comments for me, please leave that in the comment section below. Uh, but I will reiterate, especially if you're new to my channel, uh, no sexual or fetish type questions or comments. For anyone who does that, I will delete your question or comment and I will block you from my channel. Fair warning. And also, if you're a gay or bi guy and new to my channel, do not leave me any sexual or fetish type questions or comments and do not try to hit on me, okay? Yes, I shave my legs and I wear pantyhose, but I am not gay or bisexual at all. I'm 100% attracted to women, okay? And uh, so if you're gay or bi, and you think you might leave me a question or comment, uh, like a sexual thing, or, or if you think you might hit on me, don't do it. I will delete your question or comment, and I will block you from my channel as well. Uh, keep that crap to yourself. Keep that kind of crap to yourself, okay? Or go do it on someone else's channel, but don't do it on mine, okay? Uh, now, I think that's uh, just about going to wrap it for this video. 
If you made it to the end of the video, I very much appreciate it. Comment down below, road to a thousand or road to 1K. And the first person who does that, I will pin your comment to the top with my personal thank you, of course. And uh, that's gonna wrap it for this video. As always, y'all, take care, have a good one, God bless, and I will see you soon. Bye. And please, please keep in mind, men have freaking legs too. <laughs> See y'all later.